Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, thrill seeks of all ages, Coast of Chow here, Doncaster born, but built for theme parks, and welcome to an exciting theme park newsroom update, where today we're going to share with you the official online plans for Chessington World of Adventures Amazon Land for 2023, including uh, some more details on the rise of attractions in the area, including the big roller coaster, and I'm going to share my thoughts on everything that's been speculated after the online revealing of all the plans, landscaping and artistic designs. So, before we get started guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, cut the case of LC Nemesis YouTube video if you are new around here. Let's try and get closer and closer to 2,500 subs, we're nearly there, we're only like 5 subs off, so it would really help if we get there as soon as possible. We're trying to get to 3,000, 3,000 subs by the end of the year, so let's try and get there as soon as possible. It'd be brilliant if we hit 4k instead, but 3k is more realistic, uh, but if we hit 4k, that's even better. Also guys, check the description down below for social media links, the Google Forms link where you can submit your own ideas for the channel. And if you want to, you can go on back and go on a bit of a nostalgia trip and watch some of the old videos if you want. We're getting closer and closer to three quarters of a million total views, which means we're one step closer to that big one million views target, which we want to try and hit before the end of this year. And for now guys, let's share exactly a summary of what's been discovered from the plans revealed by Chessington for their 2023 Amazon Land and their brand new roller coaster within the area. So to summarise exactly what's been going on as all these planning images go flying about on your screen while I talk about this, basically what's been happening here is we have a brand new roller coaster surrounded by a couple of children's attractions to accumulate the Amazon Land area of the theme park. Now, the big surprising thing here is, and it's, it's a few little details about each attractions. Now, first of all, according to Attraction Source, of course, formerly known as South Parks, as part of the Towers Times News Group, uh, Attraction Source reported that it's expected that the children's rides, the two children's rides, are set to be manufactured by SBF Visa. Now, first of all, that for me, in my opinion, is completely unexpected. It is completely expected, uh, with Croc Drop being an SBF Visa drop tower in the same style as Magma at Poulton's Park. So I think it's very, very like it was very likely the children's ride would be manufactured by SBF Visa as part of a three for two years deal. Uh, now, obviously, the roller coaster is the big concern. However, I can confirm from these planning images and from the style of the station platform image, uh, which will either come flying across your screen or has been on your screen, either way, uh, the station platform image of the, of the artistic designs and landscaping plans shows and confirms a B&M wing coaster, a launch shuttle B&M wing coaster with an inversion, especially with the zero G roll over the station sort of area that sort of element or that sort of particular element of the coaster's layout uh, sort of gives an indication uh, that this is a wing coaster now in terms of the theme this has been the interesting discussion now obviously there is rumors and reports of a jumanji theme coming into this particular uh coaster after the site of the area and the whole style of the area looks like pieces of the jumanji board game now, I'm going to share my thoughts on all of that and the Jumanji rumour right now. There we are, ladies and gentlemen, thrill seeks of all ages. That is a summary of what's been discovered from the planning images online from Chessington World Adventures on their 2023 Amazon Land and launched B&M Wing Shuttle Coaster. Now, obviously, you're going to want to hear my thoughts. Overall, I love the look of this area. I think it's stylized nice. I think it could be a wonderful thing indeed. Now, the whole Jumanji rumour going on. I think we're sort of looking towards a Jumanji theme. Is it a Jumanji theme? We don't know. But there is a couple of pieces of evidence that fall into place. First of all, the theming structure, sort of in the middle of the, the shuttle turnaround, back, going to the backward section of the coaster. That whole theming structure could be a similar kind of structure to what we see in the old uh, of the uh, newer Jumanji sequel posters. You know, that big tiger statue. I think that could be what could be the theming structure in the middle. Also, with the Jumanji rumour, Gardaland is set to add a Jumanji-themed indoor coaster in the Ramesses The Awakening building. So, could Merlin have signed an IP deal with Jumanji to give us two brand new attractions? And it's not the first time we've seen this. Remember Imperial Leather back in 2004? 
2005, 2006, I guess, around to the, between 2004 and 2006, uh, where we had the Log Flume changed into the Flume Unplugged, and Bubbleworks rethemed at Chessington, with Alton Towers and Chessington having the same IP. So Chessington and Gardaland looks like they're having their own Jumanji IP, with Jumanji-themed coasters at both parks. So I think that's the best example I could give with that situation. So I think it is definitely pointing to Jumanji, or something similar. Maybe it's Chessington's own version of Jumanji. Who knows? Uh, but we will see. The evidence does point towards Jumanji IP, would I be against that? Not really, because I think that it's a great IP to use. Yes, it's a very limited IP, depending on the popularity of the rebooted film franchise with the sequels, with The Rock, Kevin Hart, Karen Gillian, uh, Jack Black, all those brilliant actors and actresses. So, we'll see what happens with that, but it's one of those things we'll just have to look out for. But, I think overall this is a wonderful, thrilling investment for Chessington in 2023, and I'm really looking forward to it. So, that is going to be it for this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe for more. And for now, my name is Coast Shell, keep living the coast life, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have a brilliant, thrilling, Chessington-tastic day.